Let us then begin the tale at the Battle of Cartano, where clashed the forces of the Garlean Empire and the Eorzean Alliance. Twas there in the sky above the surging armies that the elder primal Bahamut broke free of the Red Moon Dalamut. In an effort to contain this avatar of destruction, I called upon the Twelve to aid me in the creation of a prison of ether. But Bahamut would not be caged by such feeble bars. Too vast was his might, too fierce his rage. Little choice remained to me. I use the last of my strength to entrust our hope unto the future, and prepare to meet my end. As you have no doubt surmised, I did not perish. When the cage built from the essences of the Twelve was destroyed, the sky was filled with a colossal cloud of ether. This drifting energy responded to the prayers of those fighting below and to my own desperate wish that the dying realm be saved by infusing me with the power of a primal. I became the immortal phoenix, ancient symbol of rebirth. Rising into the sky, I struck Bahamut with all my newfound strength. The blow shattered his earthly form, and a shower of ether rained down upon the land. Thus began the rejuvenation of Eorzea. Believing the deed done, I relinquished my hold on that staggering energy, desirous that it should be returned to the realm without delay. But I had not reckoned on Bahamut's tenacious will, even as he teetered upon the cusp of oblivion. The dragon reached out to claim me. Alas, within my vast fading form, enough remained of the Phoenix's energy to offer Bahamut a hold, and he dragged me along in his wake. 